I was impressed with that move you pulled. Bang. And boys and girls, children of all ages. It's me, it's G, it's Double MD, the undefeated, undisputed YouTube champion. That's right, it's the Maverick, Mark Daniels, here at episode 277 of our Pokemon Mr. Dutch DX Let's Play. And guys, if you missed last episode, we went to Murky Cave, we encountered five Hoot Hoots, which is pretty insane, but none of them were shiny. Well, today, hopefully, we can turn that around. We're going back into Murky Cave, searching, scouring deep. For a shiny hoot hoot. Uh, we can't hit him from that corner. <laughs> oh well. Let's see here. So we're going to try to recruit five Pokemon real quick to build up our squad for the squad up ability. Alright. Just making sure we have the friend bow equipped. Alright, we got our Mudkip. I heard you like him. I know I do. Mudkip's joining the party. All right, so head on here. Oh, I know what I was gonna do. Turn my attacks off. There we go. But of course, if you're unfamiliar with what Squad Up is, I like to explain this every now and then. Uh, so basically, one of our Pokemon has the ability to Squad Up, and for every Pokemon in our party, it increases our chances of recruiting other Pokemon. Uh, so we can have up to five wild Pokemon on us right now. So I want to make sure we can take full advantage of that. We also have the uh, friendly ability with Charizard, Honica, where basically just gives us like a flat bonus to uh, recruiting Pokemon. And then we also have the friend bow on Beedra, which increases our chance to recruit Pokemon when you knock out a Pokemon with a Pokemon equipped with it. And then also you uh, increase your chance of recruiting Pokemon when you use False Swipe, and it knocks out a Pokemon, which is kind of cool. Um, kind of uh, similar to uh, the mainstream games where False Swipe helps you catch Pokemon. Will help. False Swipe helps us recruit Pokemon in this game, which is really cool. And then one other way you can increase your chances of recruiting Pokemon is with uh, is with an inviting orb, which we do have. So if we do run into a shiny Hoodoo, we'll pop that inviting orb. Uh, it'll increase every Pokemon we uh, encounter on that floor. Uh, increase our chances of uh, recruiting it. Pop Sunny Day. Don't want that, that hail here. Alright, we've got a cast form here. So we need two more Pokemon in our squad here for the full squad. We need one more Pokemon <laughs> for squad up here. Alright, we got a Lotad here. Goes for Growl, lower on all of our attack. That's fine with me. False Swipe. Double False Swipe, double fun. And we have ourselves a Lotad. Now we're going to swap over to Charizard. Alright. So the plan today, guys, is to just do one run through Murky Cave. Um, afterwards, Porygon Z. We don't need Porygon Z anymore, do we? At one point we did, obviously, we needed every Pokemon at one point. No, we don't need it anymore. I was going to say, we can grab Porygon Z real fast. Um, I guess I can quickly go over what Pokemon we need. Uh, if you look at the top left, you'll see that we're currently at 454 out of 473. Um, that is our current progress for our living Pokedex. Uh, we currently have 454. Uh, the Pokemon that we need are Venusaur. Let me scroll up. Venusaur. Persian Machop, Meganium, Iglybuff, Umbreon, Celebi, Trico, Groval, Skeptile, Skitty, Feebas, Roserade, Riolu, Leafeon, and Sylveon. And then we're missing four Shinies. The four Shinies we're missing are Magikarp, Hoot Hoot, Altaria, and Shiny Celebi. So hopefully today we can knock one of those off our list, that being Hoot Hoot. We'll see how things go. Nice little heat wave there. 
Yeah, getting Shiny Hoodoo would be really good. I mean, we've been having some troubles getting the area dose or hair cross we need. So getting a little bit of progress, you know, after these last few episodes where we haven't really got anything to really um, help us with our progress at all would be really nice. If we don't get Shiny Hoodoo today, in this episode, um, yeah, I can have Rin help. Move in for a drill run, take him out. If we don't get Shiny Hoodoo today, what should we do next episode? Should we go back to hunting the Ariados and Heracross, or should we try something different? I don't know. I don't know. Should we just go hunting for gummies? Could do that. Hunt for gummies instead of hunting for the Ariados and Heracross. Um, we'll see. We'll see. I'm not sure what the best option is. I feel like hunting for Heracross and Ariados... You would think in theory you would have a better chance. Because you see so many different hair crosses and area doses. And if you recruit like every other one, like, you would think your chances would be much higher of getting the one with the qual rare quality that you want versus doing a ton of dungeons, and I do mean a ton, to get candies for a chance that's uh, going to upgrade if it's just rainbow gummies in general. But even when it does upgrade uh, your rare quality, it has a chance to get the one that you want. So you would think in theory you would have a better chance just by recruiting um, Heracross and Ariados. But, uh, we've been having some rotten luck. And we've done several episodes on camera, and then I've done some runs off camera, and it's just not working out very well. We could also attempt to do Purity Forest again with Charizard, with Honica here. That's a possibility as well. And I might try that. We might try that one more time. Um, just to see how things go. We got... I think the first we got was like, you know, in the 30s. It's a 104 dungeon. I don't know. It's, it's a tough one to do. Okay, we got our first Hoot Hoot encounter here for today. Again, we got like five... Yes, uh, I almost said yesterday. Last episode. So maybe we'll get that kind of luck again, we'll see. Alright, Hoodoo's coming up. Our attacks are off, let me just double check. Yep, okay. It is a normal Hoodoo. That's perfectly fine, you guys know me. You know, when it comes to these shiny hunts, I never expect to see the shiny. In fact, it's quite the opposite. I think we won't see the shiny, because the chances are very unlikely. Unless you're hunting for Ariados and Heracross, of course, you'll see shiny Ambit Bombs. That's just the way life works. You're not looking for the shiny, and you find a couple of them, you know? But, uh... There we go. But yeah, it doesn't have to be a shiny. I just want a chance. You know, let me see some of these rare spawns. Let me have a chance of getting the shiny. That's all I want. You know? I'm not asking for much. Alright, so I'm going to go ahead and... Eat an apple real quick. So really, to meet my quote, I'd like to see like one more Hoot Hoot. But since we saw five last episode, I'm not going to be upset. The fact that we even saw one this episode is pretty uh, remarkable. If we're being honest. Yeah, we're just going to do this one run through Murky Cave today. So the episode might be a little bit shorter, but that's going to make up for a longer episode that we did a couple episodes back. It was like 45 minutes long. Um, so I'm not too worried about it being like 20, you know, early 20s on the minutes. Um, so I'm probably going to record... This is my fourth one I've, I've recorded in a row here. 
I'm gonna record a couple more. I might do six tonight, you know, um, which will give me some time to maybe do some stuff in between uh, recordings at one point. Maybe look for some area dose in Heracross again, um, or just go gummy hunting. I don't know what I'm gonna do yet. Obviously, what I'll do is um, just, I guess. Oh, hello. Another hoodoo. I guess what I'll do is if I do like gummy hunting specifically. I guess I can record when I use the gummies. Okay, so uh, no shiny hoodoos. I can record when we use the gummies, and so then I can show you the footage of me getting the uh, the rare quality if I do get it. If I mean, I guess I could just sit there and record myself. But here's the problem: I'm gonna be doing it while multitasking. Chances are. So like I might be playing like music in the background, or I might be watching a YouTube video or something, while hunting down these Ariadoses and stuff. So I don't know if I'll be able to actually record my the process of doing that. But I can at least you know obviously I'll show you guys when we get it. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. It depends on what I decide to do. Because depending on how many videos I record tonight, I might have a little bit of time tonight um, to do some hunting. Maybe a little bit. It's actually a decent time right now. It's only uh, 10 o'clock for me. Sometimes I don't start to rec you know, recording until like midnight, or if I'm doing just a couple videos, maybe like one in the morning. So, so I got a couple hours left, if not more. Depends on just if I have the energy to sit here and record, you know, another hour or so. I might. I might. I'm doing okay right now. But I do have some other stuff I gotta get done tonight as well. You know, editing stuff, that kind of fun stuff. I gotta upload some videos, schedule them out. I have a bunch of videos that I recorded, edited, and everything, I just haven't uploaded them yet. I really need to do that. Schedule them out, get them ready. So I accidentally missed uh, an upload because I forgot to to actually upload it and schedule it out. <clears throat> it was actually from Mystery Dungeon. I missed an upload for it. And I missed an upload for my tier list. Um, I just realized that today because it's actually Friday for me. So the tier list should have went up today. Well, it's not even a tier list. It's a, uh, a Sporkle quiz. So I might put that up for tomorrow and just have it late. Cause I have a record, I just gotta just gotta upload, I gotta make a thumbnail for it. No, I'll figure that out. I was considering even just skipping this week, then I have it for next week. I don't know. I've been really busy the last couple weeks as well. And also Low on energy, man. Just low on energy some days. Unable to really just like actually sit there and record. Just tired. I was not feeling great for a couple days. Just a little, little under the weather. Nothing too crazy. Am I out of heat wave? Wasn't paying attention. Excuse me. Yeah, I was a little under the weather for a little bit. Um, could have been, could have been just a little cold. Maybe some allergies. I know uh, some of my friends had some issues with allergies a couple weeks ago. One actually had to go to the uh, go get a COVID test because they work um, in a place that makes them like get COVID tests if there's like even a, the slightest chance. So he had to go get a test and he was he was fine. Didn't uh, didn't have COVID. They said he either had the uh, just a cold or allergies. 
So I'm assuming that's what I was going through as well. Just, and I didn't even feel sad. I just didn't feel great. You know what I mean? Just didn't feel myself. Just felt tired, a little out of it. You know. And then yesterday. I had to wake up early and, and work all day. So I was exhausted as well, that's why I didn't record yesterday. So I basically just, I slept a lot today actually. I slept like 10 hours. Alright, moving on to the 18th floor. We're actually only at 16 minutes, huh? Well, by the time we get all our you know, item management done, we check the shop, we check the bulletin board, we check the mailbox. If we got any gummies, you know, use some gummies on area dose. Yeah, it'll be about 20 minutes. Like I guess this will be a bit of a shorter video. So it doesn't look like we're getting shiny hoot hoot today, by the way, guys. And I think I will record uh, at least one more video, probably two more videos after this one. So I don't know exactly what I want to do yet. Do I want to go back at the area dose and hair cross? Not really. Okay, we didn't get any gummies. Um, we could shiny hunt again, which I don't think we will. I think we'll do something different. So this is kind of what I'm thinking. We could A, hunt for gummies. Right? Like, we could, uh, just do, like, the, the boosted stage, whatever the boosted stage is, the boosted chest and money stage. Could do that, right? Could check the online area, see if there's any... Thing is, like, there's never, ever enough missions in there, so I just, I don't... I don't think that's an option, really. So we could do that. Um, the boosted run. Um... Could just hunt for a specific Pokemon we need, like Bulbasaur or something. I don't know. A lot of options. A lot of options. Let's see here. Purity Forest. Yeah, we're not doing that. Or, speaking of Purity Forest, I could just uh, try to do another run through Purity Forest with Charizard. I'm looking in the wrong area. <laughs> Purity Forest. Could do that. Got both of these. Stocking up on those bad boys. I'll check the bulletin board. We'll do some item management. We'll wrap it up there, guys. Uh, next episode, I need to make a decision what we want to do. Yeah, nothing good there. Shoot, what do we want to do next episode? Let me see what the boosted stage is. Let's do the boosted stages. Last time we did a boosted stage, we didn't have very good luck, honestly. So it's Mount Freeze, huh? Now we don't need Shiny Licky Licky. What do you guys think? We do a quick run through Mount Freeze. Next episode, test our luck. Or we could try to farm our quality orbs. This is the plan. Next episode, we're going to do Mount Freeze. We'll test our luck with the gummies. If that doesn't work out, we'll do an episode where we grind rare quality orbs. And basically what that means is we're going to do this tiny wood stage over and over and over again. And after every time we do a run, we'll check the bulletin board. We'll check the Kecleon shop. We'll jump back in. It's going to be very <laughs> exciting. Um... But I think just to change it up, we'll do that. 
Um, if those don't work out, um, this, that's probably going to be it for my recording of the day. So I probably will do some stuff in between uh, those episodes. I haven't decided exactly what method I'm going to go with yet, but I'll figure that out when I get there. And try to get the, uh, the rare quality or an area dose or a hair across that we want with the rare quality that we want. We'll figure that out when we get there. But anyways, guys, thank you guys so much for watching. And until next time, I'm the Maverick Mark Daniels. Bidding you farewell, peace, and one love. Bang!